episode. Okay, today we're off to Akaru Rock, which is about 45 kilometers uh, east of Hawker. We're going to do some climbing, some exploring, and going to have a look at some cave paintings. So come along with me while we have a look and a bit of a hike up through the hills there. Hope you enjoy. About 45 kilometers out from Hawker, you'll see a sign on the right hand side saying Akaru Rock. Turn left down there. The dirt track is very accessible to all sorts of vehicles and is reasonably well maintained. Just take it nice and easy, and that'll take you into the car park. Okay, we just got here to the uh, Akaru Rock car park and we're just about to start going for the walk up. Uh, it's not a bad day today so hopefully it won't be too hard. Uh, it takes about an hour and a quarter to do the loop so doing some photographs and that on the way. Don't know how hard it's going to be or how long it's going to take. But whatever the case, let's go off and enjoy. Okay, so we're at the information bay at the moment and this is where we're going to go. This is down here at the uh, car park and there's two parts of the track so you can go up, Akaru rocks up here and then we'll come back down that the other track coming down there, come across these bridges, we'll see what they're like. Uh, it's only a 600 metre rise between here and the rock and as you can see here, it's about three kilometers, two hours return. Okay, as normal, they talk about safety. You now wearing sturdy boots, hot hats, sunscreen, water, keep to the defined tracks. So uh, I don't think we're gonna have rain today. We haven't had rain up in the Flinders for a long time, so I think we'll be all right there. So anyway, let's get on with it. Let's go for this uh, hike. So as can be seen at the moment, this trek is pretty well defined. I guess a lot of people have come through here. I don't know what it's like further on, but I'm sure we'll find out. But at the moment, an easy walk. So we'll see what happens. Keep going. Okay, one thing I have noticed about this hiking and exploring is it shows how fit you are. Whew. It's got this bit of a, an incline to go. It doesn't look that steep, probably in the camera, but I can tell you it's fairly steep. But if you take it slow, you should be able to get to the top all right. I'm puffing and panting, oh, just showing how unfit I am and how much more work I've got to do. If you look over here, look at the view. 
Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Yes. I'm hoping when we get to the top, it's going to be even better. So, I'm just going to keep walking up this hill a little bit and try and do it without breaking my neck. Just got to do it slowly. That's all you got to do. Just work your way to the top. Oh. I'll get there, don't worry. I hope anyway. Let's keep going. Well, okay, I'm about uh, halfway up. There's a seat here, so I'll take a, a few minutes and have a bit of a rest. It's not a race, I've done a race to get up to the top. I'm just taking my time, have a drink of water, and uh, just enjoy the peace and tranquility out here. I've seen a couple of other people on the track uh, walking, they're all coming down, so. Uh, looks like you can get up there all right. They're older than me, and some of them were. So I'll just keep going nice and steady and uh, enjoying it. Hope you are as well. Still got a way to go. Just hope when we get there, the pave can't, uh, cave paintings are worthwhile. I'll give you some more information when we get up there about them. And uh, hopefully get some photographs of the view from up there, hopefully, fingers crossed. So I'm just going to rest a couple more minutes and then I'm going to uh, carry on. See you on the trail. Goats stink. Just thought I'd tell you that. It's smelling from here. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, it's always nice when you come around the corner to see something that's unusual and a bit spectacular. Here we have a rock that's been, I would say, shaped by the wind. How's that? That's spectacular. Uh, of course, there are some people that have to put their name on things and spoil stuff, but forgetting all that, Look at the sheer power of nature to do this to a solid rock. It's unbelievable. Well, I've made it. 
was a bit of a walk for me, but uh, I got here. As you can see behind me here, I'll get some photographs and put on as well. But uh, this is Akaru Rock, and there's some Aboriginal cave paintings. You won't be able to see them very good while I'm doing this, but I'll get a bit of a closer look for you so you can see what's here. As I said, it was a bit of a walk, but overall, I done it. I did it, I should say, correct English. Uh, yeah, you just got to take your time. Worth the trip, though. Let's have a bit of a closer look. Okay, so I've got a few uh, pictures for you. I've had a bit of a rest. <laughs> so now I'm going to start the, the walk back down to the car park. It's beautiful up here. A bit of wind blowing through the, the trees here. I wonder if I can get this. I bet he's going to run before I can get him. A beautiful lizard. Come up for a visit. Isn't he beautiful? Going to start heading back down. Back down the track. Down through there. Hopefully it's more downhill. <laughs> well it should be. Um, it's beautiful up here. I've just had a chance to recover, have a bit of a drink. A look around. They've done a good job of protecting it. Probably needs a little bit of maintenance. But uh, yeah, it's lovely. In the valley here, in the ranges, through the trees, I can see the Chase View Ranges. I'm going to try and get a couple of photos on the way down if I can find a spot. I'll get some pictures of those for you. But uh, yeah, it's lovely. Is it worth the walk up? Yeah, it is. It's a good walk. As I said, you just got to take your time. If you're not fit, you can do it. It's just got to take your time. And uh, you'll enjoy it. All right. That's where i got to go. Down that track there. Heading down. But I bet there's some uphills as well. <laughs> All right. Unless something spectacular comes up on the way. I'll see you back down at the car park. All right, see you.
well, I'm back at the car. Got some water into me. Just had a bit of a rest, so I'm going to be heading home shortly. And uh, then I'm going to make this video. It's been a good little walk. Would I recommend it? Yep, I would actually. It's a nice walk. It's not hard, but you do need to take your time with it if you're not fit. Much like Jarvis Hill. Uh, probably a little, it is a little longer than Jarvis Hill walk though. Um, all in all, it took me about two and a half hours return. But that included my time up there uh, resting, doing some photos and some videoing. So about two and a half hours. If you allow that, you'll be you'll be right. The roads, the, the uh, tracks clearly marked, and uh, you really can't get lost to stay on the main track. Okay, hope you enjoy that. Uh, it was fun making it for you. Until next time, stay safe and enjoy life. Bye-bye.